I know you're seniors, but don't stop your message. For Coach Freddie Ramos, the McCaskey basketball team is family. You guys start opening my eyes to to different experiences you have. He knows being the target of hateful comments isn't new for these guys. It's something the team prepares for. We have to do that, otherwise it's a shock for our kids because we're not, we don't hear those things everywhere, but we're used to hearing them in certain places. To me, it's like, it's a, it's a personal thing. Like, I hate racism and like, it should never be tolerated anywhere. I feel like for us, we stay together as a team and like, we like, we, we ignore it. When a racial comment shouted at a game made headlines this season, the team decided they couldn't remain silent. We respect others. We felt as though we wanted it back. Our boys would like to share a few words with you about our feelings and need for change. The team posted this video on social media. I want to be welcomed in that community that I go. Students and adults to show more maturity. Uh, we made a video because we want, we want us to be heard. Like you shouldn't think no, you're better than anybody else, that like we should all be treated the same. It's not just about us, it's not just about McCaskey. I wanted to walk into a gym and feel respected and I wanted others to walk in our gym or any other gym and just feel respected. The message is powerful. And it isn't just boys basketball, there's a bigger problem that we're not gonna let it die now. We're just gonna keep talking about it because adversity creates opportunity. They vow not to be silenced. And there's an opportunity for us to use our platform in a positive light. These are things you leave behind that you're proud of. And Shannon, WGAL News 8.